All right, so we're going to talk about the warp tool. And this is really, really similar to the transform tool, which kind of is the same tool, it's just using it a different way. Um, but I want to show you that this, although I'm showing you this in the typography, in the sense of typography, I want to let you know and show you that it is also uh, not meant necessarily for typography. So uh, what I mean by that is when I go to my text layer, I will go to edit, transform, and I can select warp all I want, but I can't warp this, this text. I can't warp a font. So what I would have to do in order to warp it is rasterize this layer. And when I rasterize this, so it says rasterize type. So now if I go back, transform, warp, now I can begin warping this and doing some really cool things. Now, one of the things that I want to show you that is not obvious is that if you grab it from the middle you can just kind of move it however you like which is pretty cool but i'm not going to do that right now and so the reason why this guy is here is so that i can show you that if you apply the same method to an actual photograph or in a, a imported image you can do the same exact thing so let's go to transform warp and I'm just gonna actually click in here and I'm gonna expand this way and so if nothing else this this makes your image more interesting to look at than what we had before, uh, if nothing else. So yeah, um, that's the warp tool. And really it just takes a whole lot of uh, practice to get, to get used to it, but that's your warp tool and have fun with it.